I'm just making some porridge up for um, Casper and I just wanted to do a video on it so if you want to make some yourself um, so this video is about peanut butter porridge for hamsters or any other um, safe flavour now I use this one 100% just smooth peanut butter and all I've done is just put a smidgen just a tiny smidgen with a bit of porridge and then just mix that up it's really hot at the moment and then once you've mixed it up I add water to it to give him some a uh, bit of bulk which I shall do now so I'll be back in a tick right so here we are so as you can see I've just put a bit of water in mix it well and all you can smell is peanut butter and he loves it Make sure it's thoroughly mixed in. I give him this every alternate morning when I do mine. Before I put all my cinnamon and ginger in mine, I just take a scoop out and put it in here. So never ever give them porridge that you, that you put flavourings in. Always just take a smidgen out first. I think this is fine. Clean fingers. Just test. That's nice and cold. I should say cool. Right, I shall go and give it to him. Right, we'll just get him up. Casper! Casper! Which bed are you in, darling? Ah, Casper! Casper, get some porridge. Casper, where are you, Casper? Casper, Casper, where are you, dude? Casper. <laughs> Sometimes I have to waff it under his nose. <laughs> well, under his, uh, his house. Where is he? Is he, in it? is he in here? Oh, yes, he's in there. I can feel him. Casper. Hello, darling. Don't worry about his neurological problem. I know it looks worse than what it is, but... Come on, Casper, darling. There you go. And there you go. As soon as he... Um, Calms down, he's very, very still. <clears throat> and as you can see, he loves it. I thoroughly recommend you make this for your hamsters, but you must make sure you cool it down with some cold water. And he's just had a load to eat, so he might not eat all that, so I'll leave that for an hour or so. But he, uh Let's just check. It's not... Yeah, that's fine. It's nearly cold. So, uh, yeah, he loves it. He's peanut mad anyway. <laughs> and plus it gives him a bit more water. But when you think of it, porridge is a good thing for hamsters. You can put anything in it that's obviously that's safe. You could put parsley in it if you wanted. Peanut butter, as long as it's a natural one. Don't go putting some pat in or anything like that that's got um, rubbish in it. Just try and stick to the natural one. Um can mash a bit of fruit in with it like a few raspberries or strawberries and bananas or make sure they're nice and pureed up <clears throat> but I tend to keep him off the fruit bit because he's a dwarf and as you can see he really likes that he's just peanut mad so I just thought I'd share that recipe with you guys it's so simple it takes two minutes to make it gives an older hamster plenty of fibre and uh, if the hamster will eat it without any flavourings, then that's good as well. Or you could even add a bit of honey. If you've got cerian, just add some honey in it. Or you could even add a bit of honey um, in the drawer, so as long as it's not too much, but not every day. <laughs> so the, the list is endless. I mean, the stuff you can put in it is just 
And as you can see, I just I keep saying this over and over again, guys. I just wish you had smell of vision because all I can smell now is peanut butter. <laughs> but he absolutely loves it. And plus you've got to see uh, Casper again. Thanks, every oh yeah, I've got to say thanks to everyone who's uh, posted nice comments about him and wishing him well and and uh, really appreciate that. And I think Casper does as well, don't you, little Casp? So um, yeah, so there you go, peanut butter porridge. And uh, when I make some more recipes, I'll um, I'll do them for you as well. I want to get to do the. Um, Banana pancake soon. That's just three ingredients. Is it three? Hold on. One. No, two ingredients and then you're flavouring on top, whatever you want. <clears throat> so you've got to think carefully about the flavourings with that, with hamsters. But yeah, there you go. Well, as you can see, he's really, really loving it. I know he won't be able to do proper demo. <coughs> proper demos anymore guys but unless it's regarding food and treats because <clears throat> he's just uh it's just too dangerous for him to um because he just can't keep still when he's out of his cage so i have to be very careful when i have play time with him now i have to use the play pen and it's just so sad well there you go as you can see he's had a good bit of that so i'll leave that for another hour or so and see if he goes back to it and then um don't leave it out too long, guys, because it'll go very mouldy. And... So there you go. So I hope you enjoy, enjoyed that ingredients, and I'll um, put the ingredients in the description below. And if you want to have a bash at it, then uh, by all means. But you must make sure the peanut butter is melted. You don't want it being lumps in there being sticky, because you don't want them sticking in the pouches. So I'll just make sure it's nice and watery. And uh, yep, and that's it. Catch you later. Say goodbye, cast. Hey. Hey. You saying leave me alone? I'm just having a nice shower. <laughs> Bye.